Hello and welcome back to the Long Dark Interloper. We're in the uh, Broken Railroad and uh, yesterday we got chewed on a little bit by a bear. Um, just woke up next to the fire outside. Uh, I've been thinking about it and that bear chewing put my clothing in such poor condition. I think I'm going to... Well, what I want to do is get a bunch of deer hides from around here and get them cured and uh, do some repairs and maybe build another set of... Uh, deerskin pants because I can't really do anything about my bear coat while I'm here uh, and it's taken some damage and I want to get my heat uh, bonus up a bit so I figure I'll just clean up all the deer carcasses around here and uh, get my gear back in order before we head back that mean oh also uh, we found the entrance to the broken railroad ravine which I have never been in before and I've never seen anybody go in it before in a let's play so I really am kind of excited about getting down there to see what's down there. Um, uh, it's going to be a completely uh, blind uh, experience for me. So uh, that I haven't had a blind experience in this game in you know a really long time. So I'm pretty excited about that actually. And I think that's what we're going to do today. I'm guessing there's going to be a deer down there we can get, and maybe a cave. I mean, I literally have no idea, though. I just assume, based on game design stuff, that that's probably what we're going to find, and that's what I hope to find. And then we'll get that done and get it back up, and, you know, whatever. And uh, But first step is to go inside, get the rope, and we'll head down there right away. Still have five hours on the fire, but I'm not going to loiter around. It's mid-afternoon. Conditions are about as good as they're going to get. Oh, I am, I assume, too heavy to climb on a rope, which we'll have to address. So I guess that's step one. Um, yeah. My bear hide science plan is not going to work out, I don't think, but nothing ever really works out the way you want it to in this game. That's kind of the fun of it. Alright, what do we, okay, definitely don't need two bed rolls down there. That gets us pretty close already. Uh, probably not going to find a crafting bench. Definitely don't need 37 feathers. Uh, definitely don't need scrap metal. Definitely don't need those saplings. What else do we have that we definitely don't need? Definitely don't need a... Well, do we need a pry bar? There might be a locker down there, I don't know! Certainly don't need five torches. Lanterns are handy. Definitely don't need all these whetstones. Probably take one. Do I, I really technically don't need one, but... <sighs> hammer... I assume we don't need a hammer. Don't need a pry bar. All kidding aside, there's no locker down there. I'm sure of it. I mean, that would be silly. <laughs> Don't need extra long johns. I need anything right about now. Don't need that. Notice how that didn't disappear. That's because you can harvest it still for cloth. That's why uh, zero condition clothes don't disappear. Definitely need to kill a rabbit, too. So, there's that. Don't need that. Don't need that. And the thing about fire strikers is the the lower condition they are, the the less of a deal they are because they weigh 0.1 kg regardless if they only have one use on them left. So it there comes a point where you want to actually prefer them over matches. What that point is, I haven't scienced out, but you know, I'm gonna move a bunch of. Uh, good condition matches too. But we still have to carry all this crap out of here when we leave. Wait. 
the match situation. Come on, this is interloper. Let's 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 uh, dice, please. Don't need five stems. Might need two though. All right, we're light as a feather. Maybe a little too light. I'm not gonna eat more bear meat though. Don't need arrowheads. Probably don't need weapons at all, but uh, I don't really have any idea what I'm going to find down there. Uh, that's good, that's good, that's good. Don't need that. Alright, good to go. <coughs> Just leave out the back door. I would have heard if there's like another flare pistol or something down there, right? Oh, do you need a rope? Derp. So much derp. Uh, where did I see that rope over here? Oh, there it is. Too much stuff to carry. Too much stuff to carry. That particular line makes him sound like a Team America character. more bear up here? Nah. We do have bear bags. I'm gonna grab some feathers. Uh, why am I so crazy about feathers? Like, I've got... Uh, this game. Just for fun. Oh, wait. I'm over? Oh, because of the rope. Duh. Okay. failed to do was look at the coffee situation. Okay, we got three cups. We're good. Because I might need to come right back out again. Man, it's been years since I did something blind. I mean... I, I, I did play the story mode blind, but that led you around by the nose, basically, so much that it was kind of a little silly to consider that blind. I can swear I searched him. Did I not? Oh well. Is that a wolf? Oh, that's a fur branch. Okay. <clears throat> a blind experience in the long dark. And here we go. Oh, this is a tall... Oh, I want to go down. Let's not fall off the rope. Okay, we got one ledge with firewood. That's good. Ledges are good. Uh, 
No cattails so far. Interesting that that points that way. What's up there? So cold. So another ravaged wolf carcass. The only one I know about other than that is in that cave in uh, Milton. Some cattails there. I think my stomach is eating itself. I already covered this, Will. Okay, got a wolf, or a wolf and a deer. Got some ledgy looking stuff up there that looks interesting, but doesn't seem to be climbable so far. Classic tree. What I'm looking for is a cave. I just assume one exists. Because that's where you put caves at the bottom of ravines and stuff and whatnot. A jumble of crap. Maybe a rail car. Ooh, a goodie box. This will come in. <laughs> Coffee charcoal. <laughs> nice. All right. So no cave then. Doesn't go to anything. I'm not seeing any place to sleep down here. I feel like I should warm up by this deer. I really would like to find some real shelter, if there is any. picks up. This area back here might be climbable from the looks of it. If it is, it's going to be like tricky climbable. And we saw crows down here, like a person maybe was here, but there are no crows now. I'm just going to gather all this up. I can't, obviously can't go. carry it back out, but I'm going to try and sleep down here. need it. The fact that the uh, pointy tree points over there means I definitely need to look there. Our condition wasn't exactly the highest before we left. So I should start figuring it out quickly. Dead wolf, firewood. Pointy thing pointing. Glitchy rocks are glitchy. Nothing to climb. Are you sure there's nothing to climb? All right, I'm gonna warm up before before I start doing this. Gotta say, I'm getting a little nervous. This doesn't appear to be well appointed. There is totally stuff up there, though. I mean, it's 
a flat place. It looks like it's made for people to be. Oh, and here's another deer. So two deer carcasses. A buttload of firewood. place it looks like you ought to be able to get to but apparently can't no cave that I can see if I miss a caves everybody's oh a person a stem oh there are three stems on this map Oh good, a shooting guide. I, I best, I'm betting there's a rifle down here in Stalker. <coughs> That's just a guess though. Huh. Alright, freezing my ass off. Ah, oh, see now indecision is making me take damage when I shouldn't be. Alright, I definitely need to get warm, so and the place to do that is this deer over here because it looks like it sort of has a sheltered fire spot at least where was that deer? oh dear I've lost the deer there he is alright so this is the awesome sheltered fire spot for this deer I think I'm gonna get this deer, drink some coffee, and GTFO. It worked. Priorities to hide. <clears throat> Don't need the guts at all. The hot cup of coffee I just did is not in the radial menu, of course, because, you know, why would you prioritize things in the radial menu? Right. Coffee's down. Fire's up. Still overweight. Why? All the firewood. <clears throat> I didn't miss anything.
I should have used that book to light the fire. <laughs> so I'm watching for the dot for my cursor to appear so I can get on the ledge the exploitative way I'm going to drop this book I'm going to drink this coffee Still at half. I don't have a whole lot left to do. I think I'm going to take another sip of coffee just in case it helps a little bit. I think the fatigue reduction might be dependent on um, how much coffee you drink. Alright, here we go. We got another stem out of it. <clears throat> Some more coffee. Gain five coffee, only use two. Well, one and a half. Alright. Got a deer hide. Got a little bit of meat for dinner. What else can we do over here? Condition's too low. Not gonna do anything more. Good and sleepy. That's the cool thing about climbing ropes. You get nice and sleepy. Sleepy is good in this game. Alright, today we learned. take the time to grab this bear meat before <clears throat> Ooh. <laughs> I can barely walk with this much gear but you are walking will Highly doubt my fire is still going to be burning over here, but it's, I guess, possible. That would be ideal because it's actually. Uh, too late for. Okay. My fingers feel numb. <clears throat> I think I just missed the uh, Paglin's fire uh, window by a smidge. So, I'm going to rest up tonight, and to tomorrow there's uh, a bunch more um, I need to find food. deer carcasses around. Fire is still burning. That is awesome. 
I'm gonna go right to it. <clears throat> Damn, I'm freezing. That's kind of amazing, actually. We went off and adventured all day long and came back and our fire was still burning. <laughs> no kidding. Amazing. That's kind of sweet. <clears throat> so what happens to a... What happens to a deer carcass, or a deer hide out here? It does not cure. Gonna get a lot colder soon. Twiddling the wrong twiddle. I'll die if I don't get some food soon. Well, that went extremely well. So the point of doing this is <clears throat> to get some cooking skill. We got ten more skill points to get here. I looked it up last night and there are 200 skill points from uh, level 4 to level 5 for cooking. So, if you, if I don't rest you, if you cut up a bear into little bitty pieces and cooked each piece, you'd, you'd ruin your knife. <laughs> but you would get a lot of, you'd probably, you'd bore your audience to death and you would uh, probably make it to level 5 cooking in one bear, but uh, can't do it. Pretty amazed this fire was still burning. I could eat anything right now. We could sleep out here again if we have enough firewood. What have I got on me? <clears throat> Just two cedars, some sticks. That won't do it. Drop all this bear meat. And we will Okay, it's kinda stormy so we're not gonna have a problem with a <laughs> surprise. Uh, Aurora. It's walking around out here. Oh, there's a wolf right there. Yeah, <laughs> missed him. <clears throat> Yeah. 
uh, Wolf had to come and see what we were cooking. So we're not <clears throat> rid of wolves yet. Sleep. Oh, and some water. And some sleep. And we can eat bear tomorrow. Today, I should say. I do this at, at restaurants when the waitress or the, the, the server hasn't brought me um, a new drink in a while. I uh, You leave it on the edge of the table, it catches their eye when they go by. Alright, what was I doing? So... Arts and crafts supplies go in there. like having this on me. I don't know why. I feel better. <laughs> yeah. Still too many stamps. We don't need to carry this around. That's So, 0.25 kilos for some water tablets. I don't think that's quite, like, I mean, like, a kilo is two pounds, right? So, half a pound for three or four water purification... Yeah, tablets? Nah. Okay, and also we're short on this still. Got plenty of bandages, but I need to get another old man's beard wound dressing together. And condition wise, there's nothing I can fix here. Socks, but. Dumb socks. Alright. It's cold. What do we do? What do we do? Oh, fix socks. Wearing socks, so lame. Oh wait, this needs attention first. That takes definitely priority over socks. And then everything else is good. Getting weak. Will. The exercise you're getting, bro, you're getting stronger and stronger all the time. Soon you'll be very strong. Like bull. Alright. We did have wolves outside. Where'd my deer go? Uh, deer's there. Okay. Got an arrow on the ground where we shot at that wolf. Oh, Wolf's back. Hey, Wolfie. What are you doing just moseying around here like that? You must be the wolf from this yard, and the other three guys were from up up the hill a ways. Here, smell me. See my 
my treat for you. He's not seeing my treat. He's not seeing my treat. Holy balls. See, okay, so obstacles and wolf treats. Woo. Okay, you're not scared of the building that you patrol regularly. Come on, bro. Let's not be pretending here. Okay. Here is my treat. It's for you. You see my treat? It's a great treat. Okay, you see my treat this time. Good wolf. Alright. Now, where were we? Should just go straight over and get that deer over there. Because we can light a sunfire. Hopefully before we get cold. With our dumb hunting book that we, or rifle book that we carried up. Should be a deer carcass over here. If not, there's another one shortly thereafter. Cold is making my head feel thick. Oh, there's a live deer there. We could do that too. That actually wouldn't be a bad idea. There's a. Yeah, I'm gonna light a fire by this guy and then try and get that guy. spots. Not really. I've never felt so cold in my life. Will. This lying thing of yours. We really need to talk about it. Come on. Come on. Are you serious? Well, if you'd stop saying come on and jinxing it, Will. Come on. Seriously. Think of all the awesome practice we're getting. <clears throat> come on, come on. It worked. Finally. Minus two, minus one, zero, one, okay, good. Still. Not 
getting any warmer. Sorry about the pistol, but we're outdoors and there are wolves about. Just gonna lay down for a bit. It's barely good enough fire. Oh, now it's snowing. Of course. Feet. So lame. Alright, well, super fun. I really should have done something about making that fire hotter while I was at it. Like, now I'm going to take some damage just getting back to two feet away. That's not a cave, right? Yep, no. Goddamn freezing. Oh, going the wrong way in the blizzard. Getting weak. Never did get that other arrow. Wait. I'm so cold, I'm warming up again. And this is a bad time to do it. Because I'm taking damage doing it. Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. But I'm afraid I'll forget, so. If I took the time to skin all those wolves, I could actually build a wolf coat, and that would... Well... How much better would it be than a ski jacket? Bear skin coat's doing 4.6, which is just barely better than a wolf coat right now. Ski jacket is 2. These guys are... All my clothing sucks right now. Oh, I gotta get a rabbit. Alright. Definitely need to warm up. Is that just a wind change or was that. Yeah, it's just a wind change.
Actually, I should carry that with me in case I need to use it. We just had a blizzard, right? So, no more blizzards now? still basically same in, in the same situation we were before where we don't quite have enough wood to get warm. So I'm going to cruise over these hills here looking for sticks. I can't feel my hands. Where are all my sticks at? Didn't occur to me to even check the mag lens. Come on. Although starting a fire with a mag lens is maddeningly slow a lot of the time. <clears throat> First thing, cook. Then look for sticks. I'd like to just find some sticks on the ground. I'm not going to though. Alright, that's three more degrees on the fire. Reason. Well, 
lot of meat on this guy. So, uh, yeah, I didn't want to bring the meat with me. That would have been silly. Damn it! So hungry. Mm -hmm. Might actually get warm before we have to go back. All right, and we got an aurora. Awesome. <coughs> if by and by awesome, I mean not awesome, because now I have to be careful about how I enter this building. I was going to take this entrance anyway because it's the closest one, but we will have trouble getting out to the front area where our fire goes. We <sighs> can cook our food. So I can show you what I mean about this. We need to find some place to escape this cold. Right there where the door comes, we come in the door. Uh, apparently, I'm told you arrive dying if, when you come through that door. <clears throat> so that's bad. <clears throat> but over here, we don't really have any sparkies happening. Down here we do. So, since firewood is in short supply and we have a light source, I'll be prioritizing tool requiring stuff. Together, firewood. Oh. Apparently, it was just a little bit lit up before, and now it's super lit up. Could do some crafting right now, too, I think. But I'm going to focus on wood. Again, we're at 50% condition because, you know, being above 50% condition is. What's the fun in that? <clears throat> Forgot I need to drop this deer hide, too. Lock on the floor, planks, crate, nice. This is the trap you fall into. <laughs> I never knew this was a. Oh, that's pretty cool. <laughs> Where's the radio? A nice work light over there for us. Individual planks here. Might have to drop some gear.
So, wind and an aurora at the same time, that's new for me. Have some out there. Ugh. It just never ends. Yeah, I don't want to drink coffee right now, and I don't want to go to bed without drinking right now. And there's wolves. It's a freaking. Oh boy. I must have dropped that there. So, we have another door here. See any glowing green demons? I don't know why I crouched there. So the electricity won't attack me? I don't know. What well, it sounds gnarly over there. Alright, so tomorrow I've gotta make water. Okay, I'm going to call it there. It's been about an hour. I uh, put this one in, the, in uh, the schedule for uh, 
upload and uh, call that the end of the day. Sorry for uh, getting a little boring on these last few. I mean, we did get to go down in the ravine. That was new to me and maybe new to you too. I don't know. Um, I can't imagine a lot of people going down there for any good reason. Um, although we did get a stim out of it, and that's like our 97th one. Uh, but so, uh, should just be a couple more days of this. I'm going to go back up to the Hunter's Lodge, and we're going to circle around the back side of the map, and, you know, that stuff, see all those things over there. Uh, get the saplings out of here, hopefully come back, and we'll have maybe a hide or two done already, and can get our gear fixed up a bit, and, uh, start moving towards getting out of here. I know, uh, I'm excited to get the hell out of this map. It is nice to see all the new, you know, like things I hadn't really looked at before and stuff, and you know, g can gain some more familiar, familiar, yeah, excuse me, familiarity with it. But uh, it's definitely not a great map to hang out in. Um, as you can see, we're you know already low on wood after just a few days here, and you know, granted, I'm not actually out harvesting fur limbs or anything, but um, you know, it's definitely. Definitely not a great map to spend a lot of time in. Anyway, thanks for watching. See you next time.